previously on the Soviet connection, Grand Theft Auto. Here you go. Home sweet home. <laughs> now listen, Nico Belli. You are very lucky, what was an idiot. And we found a buyer for the TVs. Yes, a buyer. Can you want that Roman? Help! Shut up. Shut up. Help! Roman, shut up. Roman, shut up. Shut up. Shut up. Shut up. Oh, you better get those screens soon, or I will personally pull your cousin's stitches out. Get out of there, you're fucking dead. I wouldn't do this. Kenny Petrovic is looking after this truck. I ain't doing this. What do you know about that guy, Vlad? Nothing. He's a friend of Roman's. Really? I met him. He seemed angry. I never see him again. Why? <sighs> Disaster averted, brother. Yeah. Coming back. Uh, I'd love to, man, but I'm seeing this hot Russian broad over on Firefly Island. I'm gonna drink a daddy's expensive vodka and fuck her under the pier. <laughs> Ooh, young love, modern one. You know her? No. Good. Because if you did, I'd fucking kill you. She's my daughter. Ungrateful bitch. Look. Look what I've given her! But I don't accept my daughter turning into a whore. Nico, she's at Firefly Island. She's meeting up with that bike of her boyfriend. Get him. Find him at the airport. Okay. Have him call me. Sure. Go. All right. Am I property of the lost now? Ha, <laughs> if you were property, then all the brothers would get to share you. I want you all <laughs> to myself. Get away from Mr. Faustus' daughter. Fuck you! This ain't Russia, and we ain't communists. Tell my father I can see whoever I like. I'm gonna get the brothers, and we're gonna kick your fucking ass! I've killed the biker. I don't know how happy your daughter will be. I don't care about her happiness. I care about discipline and loyalty. Thank you, Nico. Built it good back there. You can learn a lot from watching him in a fight. Yeah, I need to do some learning. 
Mind if I practice on you, Brian? We don't want to hurt you! I don't hit women! <laughs> you can't tell me this don't give you a kick, brother! Time was we'd kick ass with baseball bats, not SMGs. Jason's been killed up and broken. He was banging some Russian broad and her heavy-duty father didn't much like it. He hired a fucking Polak to do it. I think he was a serf, Brian. Fucking slap scumbag all the fucking Shut the fuck up. Brothers, we will find a way to get payback against this Polish, Russian, Serb. I don't really give a shit. In the meantime, let's take a moment Remember Jason and all the other men who've given the finger to this shitty little thing that we call conformity. Hey Amen, Billy. Got that right. Now Jason, was, he's just a kid. But he hit the throttle harder than most of us, huh? He's a lawbreaker, troublemaker, beer drinker, and hell raiser. Uh, he didn't suffer fools. Got any piece of holy water. <laughs> Always had time for a brother in need. And he was scared of precisely jack shit. That's right. In short, the kind of man I'd want to be. Jason Michaels. Lost, but not forgotten. Amen to that. Jason. Ah. Okay, boys. The time for pussy licking and ass kissing is over. We are brothers for life, lost forever. In these perilous times, it's more important than ever that you follow your leader, and that is me. Remember. Yeah. I'll see you boys back at the clubhouse. Hello? Hello. Uh, is Mikael home? No, he's out. Okay. Uh, should I wait outside? No, no, come in. Oh, thank you. You're welcome. Sit down. Thank you. You want some tea? Sure. Mikhail doesn't let me use this anymore. Says it makes us look like barbarians. Uncivilized. Like immigrants. Oh, yeah? I know what you're thinking. It is a bit funny coming from him. <laughs> he did not used to be like this. When we were young, at home, he was beautiful. He was happy. He made me happy. But um, then something changed years ago. I never quite knew what it was. So many years I wondered what it was or what was wrong with me. That I did not see it in him. Or I changed him. Life is complicated. I, 
I never thought I'd live like this. No? When the war came, I did bad things. But after the war, I thought nothing of doing bad things. I killed people, smuggled people, sold people. And you don't worry about your soul? <sighs> after you walk into a village, and you see 50 children, all sitting neatly in a row against the church wall, each with their throats cut and their hands chopped off. You realize that the creature that could do this doesn't have a soul. God is very complicated. You mustn't give up hope. Huh. Well, I don't know about that. Привет, Лена. Привет, Ма. What is that? Uh... I tell you one thing and you ignore me! Oh. You stupid oh. bitch! Oh. <laughs> Nicobelic baby. Good to see you. Hey, you too. <sighs> what did you want? Oh. I want you to teach people to listen to you me. You want him to get us the money? Fuck the money. Mikhail, please calm down. We're already in a lot of trouble. I don't know if I can smooth things over with Petrovic. Fuck him and fuck you. Who are you, my daddy? Get the fuck out of my house. Mikhail! Get out! So, what do you want? This prig who owes me money owns a garage in Chase Point. I want you to pick up a truck and take it to him. Call me when you get to the truck. It's in Shotlar on Montauk Avenue. Go. Get out of here. Mr. Faustin, I have the truck. Drive it over to the garage on the corner of Guantanamo and Windmill. Park up inside. Sure. What am I delivering? When it's inside, trigger the explosive. It should blow up good. Maybe you'll be careful on the drive over. It's pretty volatile stuff. Explosive? What the fuck? driving a truck full of explosives around the city for Mikhail Faust. He's out of control. Anyway, I'm sorry, but if I get drunk with you and then drive this thing, I'll definitely blow myself up. I'll catch you later, cousin.
I've blown the place up. But don't pull that shit on me again. Maybe I don't want to drive around while sitting on an atom bomb. I thought you were the ice cold killer. I thought nothing scares you, man. Pussy. Hasn't anyone got any balls? You and Dimitri, you'd be nothing without me. Nothing. This is how you treat me? Hey boy, don't ah, move, don't move. The fuck don't are you move, boy. How are you? Eh? Oh, where you come from? How are you? Hey man, I'm here to see Jacob. It's Nico. Nico? Batman, what go on down there, sir? Some boy don't say beat off the door. Some boy don't say call himself Nico, say want to see a road boy. Nico? I'm a boy that bad man, man. Yo, free up the boy, man, yo. Are you a boy that? Yeah. Sure. Boy, that's come on, you. Come on, you still got to talk to Nico Jacob and thing, man. You want to control the taxi? You have people to knock on people door and thing. You have to careful and thing. No, it's okay. Yeah, man. See, you tell. Hey, don't you worry about watch it. Watch what you're doing, you know. See, you're a boy over there, so Nico. Go deal with him, see you Oh, I'm Nico. You all right? Hey, no problem. As good an introduction as any other. Yeah, me hear that, you know. <laughs> anyway, some boy I ramp with bad man, you know. I want to ask you a favor. Go on, no? Hey, my youth. Some boy them dip on the corner and thing, and the boy them sell some things and thing, and I go on, I say, oh. Them don't want to give me my money and thing, and every corner of my corner, and I want my money and thing, you know. I don't say that I go, go, you know, I want to deal with the case proper, you know, see it. All right, let me explain. It's a business thing I go on down there. Right. They are selling weed, but they're not supposed to sell weed, and they're not cutting me in. Okay. So when you go down there and deal with them, see it? Right, it's not going to be cheap. Where do I find them? Cheap? Cheap, my youth. You yeah, worry about cheap? We're not worried about cheap, you know. The boy them dip on the corner, me say the boy them other things and uh, on my corner that and thing and me say every corner on my corner and thing I'm gonna write that to the boy them go on and say oh they wanna give me my money oh something for go on with that. All right, hear me now. What bad man is saying is the boy them are some nervous, seeing? You go find him when you go up on the corner of Alpha and Salt Boat and seeing? When you go down and say you go see and and just deal with them, seeing? Right, you'll find out how them work, all right? All oh, right. All right. Yeah, you want someone to split for you? No, no thanks. You yeah, sure? I'm sure. All right. Respect. Mario, pass me some of that thing we have over there, sir. All right. Yeah. Hold that, King. Some good shit. You done clean me out. Yo, I'm all out of product. Dropping in to pick some up. Be ready. Okay, then I'll chase you. yourself stay off of me Tell Badman that I got rid of the competition. Right, Josh. The corner belongs to I again. One love, Nico. And nobody gonna fuck with I's corner no more. No things.
Dmitry. Hey. Sit down. What's the problem? What do you think? Mikael, Mr. Fausto. Uh-huh. You're given a choice. Kill your best friend or die. What do you do? And there is no way out? Not now. Not after you killed Petrovic's son. You don't have any family. You could run. Wherever you go, people will find you if they want to badly enough. And for this, they want blood. But you and Mikhail, you have so much history. Sure. Well, I killed the boy, so they want me to. No. I told them you were a hired gun. And they said, as long as you were the one to kill him, you'd be spared. <laughs> so that's the way it is. Yes, that's the way it is. He'll be leaving his house in a little while and heading for the club. Do what you have to do. You know, if there's one thing I've learned, it's that we must obey the rules of the game. We can pick the game, Nico Belik, but we cannot change the rules. See you later. <laughs> <laughs>